Well, this uh, right-wing Republican from Texas, Ronnie Jackson, has a police confrontation. The police are trying to give medical care to some people, and he is unwilling to move. He then threatens to call the governor on the cops, trying to use his authority to get what he wants. Body cam video shows a Texas congressman being slammed to the ground by law enforcement. That incident happened outside a rodeo near Amarillo last month, and Hannah is here with the story. Good morning. Yeah, good morning, Brandon. So yesterday, state police released footage of this altercation with Representative Ronnie Jackson. Whatever happened to right wingers respecting the law and obeying cops? It's surprise. It's surprising how fast their attitude has changed. The uh, Republican representative then threatened to call the governor on these officers. Jackson's office says the former White House physician was just trying to provide care for a girl having a medical emergency. A DPS trooper told Jackson multiple people asked him to get out of the way so EMS could help. Well, that led to this angry confrontation. Video shows Jackson approaching the group surrounding the 15-year-old, then appearing to have an argument with one of the people before that teenager is put on a stretcher. Bystanders restrained Jackson as he berated them and the officers, then lunged at a trooper. Well, hopefully this guy gets uh, put in jail for a little bit of time. Two other officers then took Jackson to the ground, handcuffed him, and held him with his face down. Jackson says he is happy this video is out to the public. He actually criticized the officers again in a tweet, adding the video shows what he calls incompetence of the authorities calling out specifically the Carson County Sheriff. Congressman was briefly detained but not charged for this incident. He says he does apologize for his language but not for speaking his mind. Brandon. All right.